Grammys are not something when I, I write songs Monday through Friday. You know when a song is good. You know when a song sucks. You know when a song could potentially be great. But n I, I don't. I don't think you'll find one songwriter that says, "I think I wrote a Grammy-winning song." Right? This song tell you, it just doesn't happen. Just the nomination was fantastic, but uh, I didn't go to L.A. I, I stayed stayed behind, and uh, so I got I got to actually watch the live stream with my wife, my kids, my mom, and my dad. So I think that's probably the best way I could have experienced it. I looked at a couple schools uh, because coaches were reaching out for track. I just, I just loved. I, I like the atmosphere of Misericordia. I always have. Um, just the the feel out in Dallas felt a lot more like home to me than East Stroudsburg did. So I, I just decided on on Misericordia. So I like, I just, I just liked it better. I like Dr. Payne because he was he was a brutally honest guy. So he would give me writing assignments. He kind of made up a course for me where I would go to his office and we would just kind of, he would give me an assignment, I would write it and he would critique it, show me what I could do better, uh, you know, um, what I was doing well. Uh, so it was really cool, you know, being a senior in interdisciplinary study, my, my course load was really easy. It was just a bunch of writing classes with teachers I loved. So um, he, I just always liked him because I, I spent a lot of time just sitting with him in his office. Like if I was in between classes, he was just, his door was always open, and um, yeah, I was really bummed out when I found out he passed away. He, a lot of people always told me they thought he was really difficult because of his personality. I thought he was fantastic. I think that's what you need in a college professor. Dr. Swanson and Dr. Blanchard truly taught me how to think for myself and think outside the box, and I, I, still, I still use a lot of that in, in my writing and just, just my life. Well, I mean, it's bigger now, but it was it was a small college community, and um, I think I, I visited really big campuses like Penn State, uh, you know, places like that. And there's so many people there that I don't think you get the intimate college experience. Um, so yeah, I, I would recommend Ms. Recordia to, to anybody because yeah, it's just a really good small college community.